Hi everyone. In this video, I would like to talk about the most common issues users are facing these days while trying to connect to the Citrix environment. So one of the issues that users face quite common is uh, when they try to access keyboard on their local computer, uh, it just doesn't work. Especially when they're connecting to Citrix environment, their local keyboard doesn't work with Citrix. It doesn't communicate with the Citrix environment and they cannot, even though they type something, you know, it doesn't work and they cannot make any changes. So in this particular scenario, what you can do is you can check a couple of things on your local computer. OK, the very first thing what you can check is. Uh, OK, click on this. If you have Citrix receiver on your computer, you can just right click on it and you see an option called advanced preferences click on it and you see an option called keyboard and language bar okay click on it once you click on it by default uh, it says no user server keyboard layout is selected for you know uh, do you want to use a local keyboard keyboard layout by default no user server keyboard layout is selected what you need to do is you need to change it to yes OK, you have to change it to yes. And also for language bar here, make sure yes is selected. So change it to yes for keyboard and language bar and save it. OK, this is the first solution that I would like to give. So after doing this, just log off, restart your computer and just try to connect to the Citrix environment and access the keyboard and see how it goes, whether it is interacting with the Citrix uh, virtual applications or not. Okay, this is the first solution. If this doesn't work, okay, what you can do is uh, there is another solution that I would like to provide. So if you are in a different version of Citrix, what you can do is, okay, uh, right click on Citrix workspace, click on advanced preferences. Okay, this is for the users who are in a different version of Citrix workspace. So uh, what you have to do is make sure that uh, sync only once when the session launches is selected. OK, please make sure that this is selected and also go to language bar. Make sure yes is selected and click save. OK, this is for the people who are using Citrix workspace and log off from Citrix now after making these changes and try to access the keyboard. I mean, try to connect, try to interact with the Citrix application and see how it goes if the keyboard is working fine then it is well and good but if it still doesn't work in that scenario what you can do is i would like to provide another solution uh, which is just make sure that you are on the latest version of citrix receiver or citrix workspace so right click on it click on check for updates so it looks for the updates OK, on my computer, I have a uh, I have some download available for Citrix receiver. You also check from your end. And if you have some download available, just download it, install it after restarting. Uh, I mean, after installing it, restart your computer and try to connect to the Citrix environment again and make sure and try uh, testing keyboard once again and see how it goes. OK, so this is another solution that I would like to give. Uh, test it out this should work and this applies for Citrix workspace as well whether you you are using Citrix receiver or Citrix workspace uh, look for the updates if you find some update download it install it restart the computer and try to test the keyboard again and see if it works or not okay this is another solution that I would like to give I would also like to add another solution for this particular problem uh, what you can do is uh, click on this and right click on Citrix receiver you see connection center here click on connection center and once you click on connection center you see this on the screen okay uh, click on preferences here and click on local ime once you click on local ime it says you know enable server ime set local ime to high performance mode set local ime to best experience mode okay so what you can do is you can toggle you can select this and click apply and click OK okay if it doesn't work what you can do is you can also try testing with 
uh, set local IME to best experience mode and click apply and click OK. Restart your computer and test again. So this is another solution I would like to add to this particular uh, video. OK. And the last one is if you are working on Mac uh, operating system, uh, then what you can do is I think you have to shift the focus. So if you are in Citrix environment, just click on command tab, I guess. Click on command tab and come out of Citrix environment and try to reconnect to Citrix again. I mean, try to go back to Citrix virtual desktop or Citrix application. So you, know, you need to just shift the focus once. Once you shift the focus, uh, try to access Citrix uh, virtual applications using the keyboard and see how it responds. So this should probably take care of the issues for, uh, you know, for the people who are working on Mac computers. If that doesn't work, even Mac uh, computer users can also update uh, Citrix workspace or receiver, try to restart and try to connect again and see how it works. So these are some solutions that I would like to give for this particular problem. So uh, try it out and at any point in time, if you have any issues, uh, you can always leave a comment. Okay. Uh, I hope you find this information helpful and you can always reach out to me for any help. Thank you for watching.